All right, I'm gonna make some whole tomatoes with some elbow macaroni on the firebox stove. You also want to take out the ash pan and just make sure it still fits in the closed position of the stove. But for now, I'll leave it down here. All right, now I'll put the whole tomatoes in the pan. And I'll chop them up just a little bit. All right, I chopped the tomatoes up a little bit. And I'm just gonna heat them up before I boil the water. Alright, sauce is nice and hot. I'll just put that aside for now. Right, now I'm going to boil up some water for the pasta. A little bit of olive oil. Half a teaspoon of salt. All right, the water's boiling. And I'm gonna put in one pound of macaroni. Oh, also, I like to pour pasta over the back of a metal spoon. This way here, it doesn't go in all at once and stick together. It spreads out, and it also doesn't splatter me. All right, the macaroni is cooked. And I'll move that right over here. And I'm gonna heat the whole tomatoes back up. All right, the tomatoes are hot again. All right, now I'm going to take the stove pull the ash pan out I'm going to dump the coals right in there I'm going to let the stove cool it off for just about two minutes. All right, it's been two minutes. I'm going to take the ash pan, put it on the bottom, and tap it in so it's a little snug. Turn the stove over to here. Now I'm going to take my pasta. And I'm going to dump it right down inside the stove. Just like that. And I'm going to let it drain.
Yeah. Yeah, and a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. A little bit of butter. And you got a whole tomatoes and elbows. There you go. All done. Whole tomatoes, elbow macaroni, and fresh baked bread. There you go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not sharing it. All right. After using a stove like that, instead of washing it, I'm just starting to fire in it. I'm going to burn off the macaroni and dry out the water. <laughs> 